While COVID-19 shrunk economies around the world, this crisis provided an opportunity for many to potentially bounce back stronger than ever. This opportunity is especially clear for the African continent. The bigger the risk, the maximum the return. That's the mantra of Nana Kwame Bidiako, a real estate mogul who hails from Ghana. Look at things, he clearly appreciates Africa's art, more like a prince of Africa. The COVID-19 pandemic has brought about a provoking and an unprecedented downturn in the global economy. They will need our uh, gas, they will need almost everything we have, our cocoa, our chocolate. But then why should we trade it from the governmental aspect? Entrepreneurs and the society at large is facing unprecedented challenges. The best quality you have is that passion, is that drive that motivates you to do what you have agreed to do you know and even though you're not being given what you deserve you still gave what they deserve as a successful young man from ghana what has been his drive i embrace the mindset of the younger generation of today you know they have realized that they have a say they have stood up to stand by their stance and they also believe that we should be able to do the things that we're striving for ourselves. Now, most of the time, we have great ideas in mind. But procrastination is our biggest mistake, at least according to Kwame. Don't give up. I believe that if we are able to make sure that these platforms are established and these employments are created, your future is brighter than what you expected and anticipated. Africa is endowed with a large amount of natural resources that has been extracted and exploited for centuries. But this has not quite helped a huge chunk of its dwellers escape poverty. We always talk about the resources that we have. We've always talked about how much gold we have, how much this and that and oil. There. But we've never talked about what platforms that we have built to industrialize the resources that we have on the ground. That's something that we've never looked at. We've just been proud of what we have. But what's the point being proud of what you have when you don't know what to do with what you have? One more lesson I learned from Kwame is that vision is indeed the secret behind every success. So Kenya, I have it right in my heart. Wanjiro Maina, K24 TV.